Hey what's up guys this is Akshay from AS Learning and today in this video we'll be seeing about the multiple sources of data sets on internet okay so for building any model or doing any data driven activity you need to have a very good source of data a very good quality of data um, generally uh, not having good quality of data or insufficient data is one of the major problems faced by uh, data solutions team in any company and uh, to solve that problem that there have been various startups also like building fake data synthetic data and uh, various other startups are built around this solution only but today in this video we are going to see about some uh, publicly available data sets or uh, even some paid sources okay where you can find paid data okay so um, generally if you are into colleges or if you want to do a POC for any company okay um, or if you're doing into your masters or a PhD generally people opt for uh, publicly available data sets okay and um, and even such data sets are uh, openly available on internet and they are uh, made available by uh, open source developers and uh, creators so that it will help the community to take it to the next level so we'll be going to see one of uh, some of the most uh, top uh, sources of quality data set which you can have for your data driven solution okay so one of the uh, source which i came across is data.goe here you can find data sets for uh, various categories uh, you can search for whatever category you want and on the base of the category you can find lots of data sets okay generally uh, this seems to be uh, US government uh, kind of a, a, a website where generally I think a, a US government uh, have open source this data set it seems like that only okay and it's a very good source uh, for your data driven solutions okay there are lots of data sets here Another uh, very popular source, I don't need to mention it, everyone knows it and it's a go-to place for many people, that is Kaggle, okay. Many people go here and you have lots of notebooks also are related to these data sets. So Kaggle is one of the good data, uh, data source, okay. Then uh, another uh, very beautiful website which I found was datahub.io, okay. Uh, it uh, uh, you, uh, you can see from the UI they have segregated it into uh, various uh, subcategories and let's say if I pick football for example because FIFA World Cup is going on so we can see a lot of data set links here even we have World Cup links also okay so you have sub links also here and uh, yeah it's a good place where you can check if you can get your relevant data sets okay even it is also very properly segregated into different categories so it will help you out next is uh, know your data with google okay so uh, yeah all you have to do is just explore your own data set and uh, Okay, here uh, you have the data sets being exported from TensorFlow, I guess. Okay, so all the TensorFlow data sets are here. And uh, I think if you explore more, you can find lots of data sets here also. So yeah, TensorFlow is also one of the very popular hub where uh, you find your data sets. Okay, and uh, I think, uh, Okay, so I think this itself is coming from TensorFlow only. I was about to tell you about TensorFlow. Yeah, so this is, I think, the data set repo maintained by TensorFlow. Okay, and uh, yeah, if you want majorly computer vision based and deep learning based data sets are uh, very primarily available here. And a lot of models have been built around this legendary data sets only like Cifar, then ImageNet, these are the data sets responsible for bringing the revolution in computer vision. Okay. Yeah. Then the next, uh, we have a link of, uh, public data sets. Okay. I did it, uh, and I got Amazon link also. So you can see the data sets available by Amazon. Okay. 
then uh, another page from where i was redirected here was this github repo of uh, awesome data awesome public data sets uh, it is maintained by a lot of contributors 157 contributors and you can see a lot of subcategories have been maintained and in this way you can find your data set for these categories it's a good github repo for your data sets okay amazon i already covered then google have uh, created a separate search engine only uh, for data sets let's try it out uh, maybe let's go for football let's go for f uh, okay let's keep simple first let's just do football okay it is giving me kaggle links also okay interesting and it, it also has data hub io oh it's a data dot world also nice so it's like a search engine it's very beautiful you can find data sets from all the sources here so beautiful all you have then you then we need this one link that is data search a data set search of google and it will help you redirect to the proper data set sources great fifa uh, okay this seems to be updated on june 8 so not the recent one this seems to be of november 8 okay let's try this out data.world is another uh, website which i know for uh, data sets okay before uh, choosing any data sets uh, please have a check of its license okay many times the license it's not available for uh, public usage okay so if you want to do any uh, create a model from which you are going to generate a revenue so please check the license first so so that later on it should not be an issue okay let's see for fifa if we get something here yeah okay i think it was it was uploaded like three years ago but uh, Okay, I will have to join this up. Okay, data dot world. I know is another website where you can find good data sets. Okay. Uh, okay, so they have scraped it from sofifa dot com. Okay, great. Fine. And last but not the least, which I wanted to cover was Hugging Face a data set. Even here also on the basis of your subcategories, you can find a lot of data sets. Okay. So long short story, I feel uh, it's a very good place. If you want to just uh, go and search your appropriate data set, you can come to data set search of Google. And I think 90% of the time your work should be done here only because it will help you with a lot of the links of data world, Kaggle and others also. And let's say if you're looking for something specific, then maybe you can go to hugging face or some other uh, other at the links also yeah so another one very public uh, very legendary source is the sk learns uh, open source data set not quite just seven eight data sets which are used by the entire world as the first data sets to do uh, their machine learning modeling and another one is uci uh, data sets i'm not currently sure if i'm taking the current name but i think so it is the uci repo only uci or yeah this one this is also very popular and very old uh repositories of data sets okay so sk learn and uci you can find your task based classifications okay and yeah so long short story i think uh, if you want to find any data set the first thing should be coming should be your on google data set search and uh, if you want a more cleaner and a more simpler data set then you can check for uci and sk learns def default uh, data sets if you're looking for more advanced data sets for your phd thing kind of such kind of things then you can go for hugging face tensorflow and i think it should help you out with your whatever relevant tasks okay so if you find anything useful uh do give it a thumbs up uh share it with your friends join the whatsapp community and uh, stay tuned to AS for more such amazing tech stuff. Take care, peace out.